Welcome to The Know, I'm Ashley Jenkins, and if you follow this stuff like I do, you'll know we've launched a lot of stuff into space, and most of it doesn't come back again, it just sort of goes away. Take Filet, the lander for the European Space Agency's Rosetta mission. They put that thing down on a comet, flying through space at 84,000 miles per hour, then bump, it lands in a little bit of shadow, and dies. Well, there's one such sad story that's just gotten a little bit happier, at least. The UK's Beagle 2 Mars lander, which went missing in 2003, has been located on the surface of Mars after more than 11 years without contact. The lander was scheduled to reach the surface of the planet on Christmas Day in 2003, but the ESA was unable to raise contact with it at the expected landing time or at any point afterwards and declared it lost the following February. Former Beagle 2 mission manager Mark Sims of the University of Leicester expressed his relief at the rediscovery, saying, I am delighted that Beagle 2 has finally been found on Mars. Every Christmas day since 2003, I've wondered what happened to Beagle 2. To be frank, I'd all but given up hope of ever knowing what happened to Beagle 2. The images show that we came so close to achieving the goal of science on Mars. The lander was spotted by former ESA Mars Express Operations team member Michael Kroon when he analyzed images from the Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter's High Resolution Imaging Science Experiment, and further re-imaging and analysis by HiRISE, NASA JPL, and the Beagle 2 team confirmed it to be the lander, just three miles from the center of Isidus Planitia, the lander's target area. The images also show that the lander survived touchdown and partially deployed its solar arrays. It's good to start the week off with some solid science fields, don't you think? What do you think of this rediscovery? Let us know in the comments. You get the best in video games, entertainment, and feel-good space right here. So make sure you like this video and subscribe to this channel, and we'll keep you in the know.